Well, a new Sioux Falls firefighter who knows American Sign Language is hoping to help improve communication between the fire department and the deaf community. Sioux Falls Fire Rescue actually has special equipment that they will install in homes for free. Got a little as Matt Holson tells you about an open house now set for next Wednesday night. From smoke detectors with strobe lights to bed shakers, Sioux Falls Fire Rescue wants to get the word out so this equipment can be put to good use. Fire! Get out! So when that hears the smoke detector going off in the other room or above the bed, it'll actually vibrate the pillow. There's Fire a Inspector device. Tyler Churchma says the idea for an open house next week for the deaf and hard of hearing community came in part from a presentation from new firefighter Kyle Blakesley. As a first year firefighter, we have to do a presentation to our crew and I decided to do mine on um, the deaf community and how we can, um, as first responders, help them better. September is Deaf Awareness Month, and we want to show our support for the deaf community. Blakesley studied American Sign Language at Augustana University and was an interpreter for the Sioux Falls School District. She says a lot of people don't know these devices exist. The open house will change that. To teach about fire safety and the smoke alarm program and kind of just build a relationship with the deaf community. These devices are specific to the deaf and hard of hearing community. Together, they're worth hundreds of dollars. But if you live inside Sioux Falls city limits, they're free and so is installation. We're kind of piggybacking off our current smoke alarm program that we do offer to the citizens of Sioux Falls. Churchma says he's installed the alarms in a handful of houses recently. When we do go into these guys' homes, um, they had no idea that these were available. He hopes the event opens lines of communication that make the community safer. In Sioux Falls, Matt Holson, Kelloland News. The open house will take place at Station 3 at 37th and Minnesota at 7 p.m. Firefighters and interpreters will also be on hand to give tours on the station and talk about other fire safety topics.